savages are killing businesses a terrible time of well, night. Well, well. Bon pas. According to the great teachings of our master, this land is our heaven, and the two oceans are our shells. It is only here that we can truly be ourselves, where man can find his place in heaven. This, this is Chelonia, the one true American's religion, the one true Bible that was handed down 100 years ago, this year, to our prophet from above. Hello. Hello, sir. Can I interest you in Chelonianism? Uh, I don't know. Can you? Well, I hope so. It is a fascinating religion that was taught to a very wise master about a hundred years ago in a land not very far from here. Take a book, please. Okay. You've made a wonderful choice. It is a religion of safety. A religion made by gods who understood what life is. Not what life could be, but what it is. And it is very dangerous. But with Chelonianism, it can be safe. Well, it's all in this book. Uh, am I boring you? Uh, a little. I'm sorry. Have a wonderful day. Please. This kind of closeness cannot happen overnight. Hey, so yeah. Let us pray together and give thanks for our redemption. Look out. Redemption of Been some trouble around here. Bonjour, monsieur. This is Chelonia. Hello, we mister. All Chelonian. Yeah, bonjour. Embrace your hey there. protector. Bonjour, Embrace monsieur. Embrace all that is sacred in this place. I'm told the savages are giving bit. Seek and ye shall find, and what ye shall find is the great shell, and the great shell is Chelonia. And this is Chelonia, the greatest shell of all. The two seas, and the isthmus, and the frozen north. Thus, we are safe to love, safe to seek the greatest wisdom, and the greatest wisdom will hey, be partner. to us. Hey, partner! Come on, oh, man. Hello. Calm down, we You might not have You don't mind me though. saying, um... You look lovely today. Well, didn't mean to intrude. Be safe out there. Hey there! Hey there! Is it time to end this nonsense and let us vote? Gentlemen. Hello. Hello there. Hey there, partner. Excuse me, pardon. Hello, Hello ma'am. I've had better days, that's for sure. Okay, bud. Fantastic. 
you Americans are nothing but shysters and traitors and slippery tongue bull suckers. I'm inclined to agree. Ah, here, help me please. Back to work with a bloody smile. <laughs> no problem, Marco. You are the great genius, so we shall the hot poker up the ice. Say thank you, Marco. Thank you. Oh, thank you. What are you, some kind of uh, European toy maker? No, or? I am a fucking genius with poker up the ice, like I say. <laughs> toy maker. Hello? Do I look like I should entertain children? No. No, he says. <laughs> no. <laughs> I am the savior of the mankind, buddy. Yes, you meet him. Professor Marco Dragic. <laughs> the one the silver tongue American betrayed and not paid the money to. Yes, he told to shit, man. So, uh, what's this toy about? It is not a toy, Big Nuts. It is demonstration of my genius, of my ideas about the source of life. Oh, it's a toy boat. Yes, it is a toy boat that I can power remotely using electricity and waves you cannot see. Good for you. <laughs> waves I cannot see. And still the investors will not come. Just a couple of old ladies and a moron. <laughs> ladies, please. <laughs> Ladies! <laughs> Gentlemen! <laughs> Enchanté! <laughs> yes. Hello! Hello, sir! <laughs> okay, uh, how is the piles? Yeah? Good, good, good. Okay. Uh, my friends, you are about to witness history. A demonstration of my infinite insight. All of us, we feel old. You. You are old. Oh. But maybe I can make you immortal. Mm. <laughs> Using waves you cannot see, I will power this You're boat. a goddamn fraud. And this buffoon dressed up like a buffoon is a stoolie. I watch them conspire, you morons. <laughs> I never met this buffoon before two minutes ago. Isn't that right? Which part of it? Oh. So, Professor... Show us your magical toy boat. Only this time, let the buffoon control it. Check if there's any funny business. No, this ain't nothing to do with me. Come, please, please. Uh, it is easy. Any moron could do it, and I am about to prove that. Here, take this, and this, and... Uh, don't touch that. Use these ones to steer, and this one to shoot torpedoes, okay? Yes, now, now blow up the little battleships and, and avoid the sea mines. They have magnets attached. Make a nasty explosion if they touch the bot. Okay, if this silly dimwit can use torpedoes on boat to destroy the battleships, imagine what technology can do in the hands of certified genius! And I have a certificate. Even little boats can sink, okay? Please! If you hit another mine, the boat is kaput. Understand? No wire like telegraph, no pulley system underwater, only waves in the air. This is remarkable. Think of those poor boys on the H.L. Hunley. Eight of them perished to a mere five on the Housatonic. And what a way to go. Trapped in a box at the bottom of the bay. I suppose you intend to make an unmanned killing machine? You misunderstand. This is the secret to life, not death. Migration of the soul. I make lifeless metal breed like man. Well, I'm not sure about that.
Torpedoes do not have so much range. I am an invisible wave engineer, not a rocket physicist. 